Stretches for handball sports. Stand at the top of your mat, feet hip distance apart. Interlace your hands behind your back, breathe in, gaze up. Exhale, forward fold from your hips. You can bend your knees as much as you want. Bring your arms over your head, dropping your head down to the ground. Anchoring your ten toes to the earth. Now place your hands to the front of your mat and step your feet back. Making inverted V-shape with your body. This is called downward facing dog. You can walk your dog, bending one knee at a time. Stretching your right hamstrings, left side, bending both knees. Lift your hips up and slowly bring your heels down to the earth. Now lift your right leg up, bend your right knee and twisting, gaze forward. Bring your right foot between your hands, placing your left knee down to the earth, left toes tucked under, inhale, reach your arms up, exhale, twist to the right, opening up your arms like wings, spreading your fingers wide. You can even lift your left leg up, placing your right arm on the left leg and then right arm behind your back, so reversing. Cart with your arms to the earth, hands shoulder width apart, feet hip distance apart to down dog, lifting your left leg up. Bend your left knee, twist, open up your left hip, gaze forward, step forward, left foot between your hands, right knee on the earth, tucking your right toes under, arms up, breathe in, exhale, twisting to the left, gazing back to your left thumb, you can lift an option, working harder, right leg up and then reverse it. So this time right arm over your head, left hand on your back leg. Cart with your arms to the earth and step back to your dog. Hands shoulder width apart, walk your dog, really anchor your fingers in the earth, knuckles down, thumb knuckles down. Walk your feet forward to the top of your mat, feet are hip distance apart. Interlace your hands behind your back halfway and then drop your hands down to the earth. Slowly come back up. Stepping your right leg back. So Wide leg forward fold, interlace your hands behind your back, exhale forward fold, shimmy your shoulder blades towards each other. For a deeper stretch, shoulder stretch, you can have your palms together, make sure your feet facing each other. Now place your hands underneath your shoulders, wrist against wrist, lifting your right arm up so you're twisting, gazing up to your right thumb, breathe in, keep on pushing your hips back and exhale, right arm down. Lifting your left arm up, spread your left fingers wide. Feel this lovely stretch as you twist, draw your abdomen in, gaze up to your left thumb and exhale, left hand next to the right. Hands to your hips, micro bend your knees, breathe in, stand tall and exhale, stand tall at the top of your mat, reaching your arms up, bend your elbows and placing your right arm underneath the left arm like a soft rope, bending your knees, placing your right leg over the left. Now you may wibble wobble, that's okay. It's okay to challenge yourself and you can always try again. Do it again, stand tall, reach your arms up, bend your elbows, right arm underneath the left, right leg over the left like a soft rope, hugging your thighs together. Pushing your elbows away from your chest so it's a hip opening and a shoulder opening. Plus you're focusing your mind. You're gazing to a steady point on the ground. Breathe in, come up, unravel your arms and legs. Reach your arms up, exhale, sit down. Left arm underneath the right, eagle arms. Left leg over the right, hooking your right calf with your left toes. Keep on squatting down, pushing your elbows away from your chest. Breathe in, come up, stand tall. Now interlacing your hands, forward fold and halfway lift, long spine, step to high plank and exhale, bring your hips down to the earth, relax your ten toes to the earth, interlace your hands behind your back, lift your chest up and slowly bring your hands underneath your shoulders, coming to neutral cat knees underneath your hips, gaze up and then gazing to your belly button for a lovely stretch for your spine and then cross your ankles, sit down, bring your feet forward to three-legged tabletop, placing your hands back, fingers pointing towards you, placing right ankle on the left upper thigh, lift your hips up, drop your head back, keep on lifting hips up for a stretch for the entire front side, 
hamstring stretch. Bring your bum back down to the earth. Sit closer to your left knee and tuck your chin in. Now reverse it to the left side, left ankle on your right upper thigh, three-legged tabletop, lift your hips up, really push your hands in the earth, drop your head back. Again, a stretch for your entire front side, turning your back side. Bring your hands forward, sitting down to a sitting down pigeon, tucking your chin in, sitting a bit closer to your right knee. Sit upright and then opening up your knees wide. Soles of your feet together, inhale and exhale, forward fold. Bring your head a bit closer to the earth. Keep on pushing your knees towards the earth. Hip opening and then sitting upright again. Bending your right knee, placing your right heel to the inside of your left leg. Interlace your hands, reach up, breathe in, exhale, forward fold. You can place your hands down to the earth and bring your head slowly closer to the earth. Reach your arms up, inhale, twist to the right, exhale. Now your right arm like a leverage behind your spine. Mudra of your left hand, index finger, thumb connected. Balancing out left side, bend your left knee, place your left heel to the inside of your right leg. Keep on flexing right foot, inhale, arms up, interlace your hands and exhale, forward fold. Dropping your head slowly towards the earth, stretching out your right hamstring muscles. Breathe in, come up, exhale, twist to the left. This time left arm behind your back, chin mudra, yoga mudra of your right hand, index finger, thumb connected. Now crossing your ankles and opening up your fingers wide, breathing comfortably. Namaste.